I would err on the side of caution. I mean, we can see, and my family didn't, my family did not evacuate in Helene in Florida, but now they are for Milton. Um, and so, so better safe than sorry, do what you can to prepare to mitigate as much as you possibly can up front. And then, um, you know, be patient, be kind, be helpful in the aftermath. And it's really a community collective effort, again, from the federal government down to, you know, that single person in the community. I'm so glad I asked you that question because your your tone and your experience just resonates in such a powerful way. And I think that this is another reason why veterans are so well suited to lead in government because they're, you know, they're leading the response, whether it's at a congressional level, at a mayor level, at the at the federal level. Um, you know, veterans know how to deal with situations like this. And even just hearing you talk about it, you don't sound like an average uh, member of Congress. And I think that's one of the reasons why we need you and, and voices like you. Um, in, in Washington and leadership across the country. So